Superhero Facts, Black Panther Edition. In the comics, Shuri was always obsessed with becoming the first female Black Panther her entire life. Oh boy, I, I didn't even say anything about his ridiculous tweet concerning Shuri, but I gotta say something about this because this is how you know the man doesn't read comics. I don't know where he's getting his information from, probably Quora, Quora whatever it's called, probably, but let me, let me show y'all something. So, the first female Black Panther. Are we pretending that there were no other women Black Panthers? Is, is that what we're pretending? We're pretending there's, that's not a woman right there? That's not a woman? Soups, do you know who Turkana is? She's a past Black Panther. You know how I know she's a past Black Panther? Because unlike you, I actually read the books. Black Panther is a mantle that's been passed down through generations from warrior to warrior. All these people are warriors, past warriors. The Black Panther mantle is thousands of years old. T'Challa's bloodline is thousands of years old. Come on now, Shuri is not the first female Black Panther. Now when Shuri did take the heart-shaped herb, she was actually rejected by Bast because of her jealousy of T'Challa. Yeah, actually it was her pride. That was the reason she was rejected. She put too much faith in science and technology. She was too prideful, prideful in herself. She literally says it right here, you know? If you really read comics, you would know that. It wasn't because she was jealous, it was because she was too prideful. And we kind of saw how she was in the first Black Panther movie. She scoffs at tradition, you know, she, she, she just thinks she's better, better because she's smarter. There was also a point where T'Challa became king and Shuri became Black Panther, and she was trained by heroes like Wolverine, Spider-Man, Black Widow, and Kazar to become a better hero. Every, every word just further puts him in a hole. Will somebody please explain to me what is this dude talking about? Suits, I thought you said that these were superhero facts about Black Panther. I don't hear any facts. All I hear is ignorance. Number one, this proves you don't read comics because this is a zero war cover. <laughs> this cover doesn't even match up with what you're talking about. The story you're referencing is called Claws of the Panther. And in that story, it was only Logan who helped her. She went to him to learn how to better control her berserk mode. She didn't get any training from Spider-Man, Black Widow, and Hawkeye. It was only Logan that she went to. Ladies and gentlemen, this is what happens when you don't read the books and all of your knowledge of these characters is rooted in the MCU. This is the difference between Marvel fans and MCU fans. MCU fans, they don't know nothing because the MCU, it nerfs everything, it makes a joke out of everything, it, it adds stuff, it takes away stuff. <sighs> when you're an MCU fan, you say stuff like this in your videos. You make silly tweets about how Sherry needs to prove herself or whatever he said. It's just all silly.